Hello, you wrong and yet another sad day. I bring you sad news, the very sad news that Dave Myers, one half of the Hairy Bikers, has succumbed to cancer, aged 66. Cy King, the other part of the double act, said he's going to miss him, Dave Myers, every day and the bond and friendship we shared over half a lifetime. So if you'll allow me, I just want to read what Cy King has written. It's, it's beautifully erudite. Um, and he wrote it on X of all places. And this is sort of a, an RIP, an homage to Dave Myers, who brought pleasure and joy to so many people via the Hairy Bikers and all of their varying projects. But Cy King wrote of his dear friend, I'm afraid I bear some sad news. Most of you will know Dave has been fighting cancer for the past couple of years. Last night, 28th of February, 2024, with Lily, Dave's wife, his family, close friend, David and myself, by his side, he passed away peacefully at home. All who knew Dave are devastated at his passing. His beloved wife brought him such happiness as did her children, who Dave loved like his own. Personally, I'm not sure I can put into words on how I feel at the moment. My best friend is on a journey that for now, I can't follow. I will miss him every day and the bond and friendship we shared over half a lifetime. I wish you Godspeed, brother. You are and will remain a beacon in this world. See you on the other side. Love you. So I also said, I know Dave and his family would want me to thank all of you who sent messages of support in recent times. It meant the world to him, his family and all the Hairy Bikers team. I am sending you all much love and gratitude for those simple acts of kindness, the generosity and spirit. We are eternally grateful for them. And may I ask you all for one further kindness and allow Lily, his wife, his family, close friends and I some time and some peace to process our huge loss. I am sure I will see you all soon. I think it's beautiful. It's, it's obviously a very difficult time, the loss of a loved one. But he was very much loved, Dave Myers. Bit of a character. I, I, I don't know whether you remember him on um, Strictly, dancing with Karen Hauer, the dancer. He just lived life joyously and to the full. But they have a TV series, The Hairy Bikers Go West, uh, on air this month. And it sees them travel down the UK's West Coast. That's UK, not America, West Coast. Uh, and in the first episode, he told viewers it was a dream come true to be back on his motorbike because he wasn't sure I'd ever get back in the saddle again, I quote. There was a time I couldn't balance, I couldn't walk, I didn't think I'd be getting on a bike, Dave said. In an interview to mark the start of the series, Cy King said filming it had been joyous because Dave Myers was a West Coast lad from Barrow in Furness, Cumbria, which sounds very much like the Northeastern accent. This one was particularly special in general because of Dave's health and his sheer and utter determination and love for what he does, Cy King said, especially to continue to do it whilst he was having treatment, took remarkable courage and energy. A sad, sad day indeed. And a bit of a, I don't know where, when you heard the, the news, a bit of a dull thud to the, the tummy. Because we're, everything is up in the air. Everything is uncertain. Everything is unstable. There's no stability anywhere with, with our celebrities. I mean, now it's 2024. And nowadays, our celebrities are those with the best bodies and the, the prettiest faces. It's got nothing to do with talent anymore. Why? Because agents want to make money. It's not about the celebrities themselves. Where look, look at Dave Myers. A talented, talented, talented chef along with Cy King, the right kind of celebrity, not because he looks good. That's where we are in 2024, vapid 
superficiality. Vacuous superficiality. There's no depth to anything. And food, if I may say, and be so bold, you have to prepare food lovingly because you can taste angst and turmoil in what the chef has prepared. And from watching the hairy bikers, Dave and Si, they always prepared it with joy, with ebullience, a, a, a joie de vivre. And we've lost one of them. A very, very, very sad day. And I just wanted to bring that news to you within context. Because I'm sure it'll be all over the news media today. It'll be in the newspapers tomorrow. But I just wanted to mark Dave Myers' very untimely and sad passing. And quote the beautiful words of his oppo, his brother, in arms. Psyching.